for text. Good to know. Ooh, there's herbs over here. I wonder how long it's been like this. And how long, like, how long have I been beastie? Like, like, how long ago was, um, you know, what happened in the cathedral? Because the way they make it sound, made it sound like it was quite a while ago. But, how long ago is that? So you can't skin spiders. Hmm, there's no. I think there might be a type you can skin, but they're not here. I vaguely remember Bone Spider. But I don't know any of the details. And that might have even been a different game. Okay. Shanky, shanky. Poison. Uh, nature damage every 3 seconds. <laughs> Wish you would say how much nature damage. Even if it was without uh, taking into account my armor or resistances or whatever. Would be nice. But apparently that's asking a bit much. There we go. And yes, that fucking spider had a hunting rifle on it. That totally makes sense. Probably it's just uh, due to something out all here about pistol shot. It's making me wonder. Actually, no, it's draw a concealed pistol. It's just an ability. All right. I thought it was like you could do a wield gun and a um, sword. You know, swashbuckling kind of badass. Move, but seemingly not. Deadly poison goes there. 50% uh, chance to poison enemy for 44 nature damage over 12 seconds. Subsequent poisons deal instantly 6 damage. Nature damage. And this is Huck, a poisoned coated knife, doing 18 damage and employing the poisons. Uh, lethal and non lethal. That are active. You. The gray a friend of mine. Right. There we actually casted it that time. You've done well, Cor uh, Garant. The spiders are everywhere, however. And I'm afraid we've barely put a dent in their numbers. The spiders keep coming in alarming numbers, Cor uh, Garant. You're going to have to go into their lair and kill the Broodmother. We've spotted the giant spider known as Genna at the edge of the Black Vault in an area covered in thick webs. Be dangerous, but we're all counting on you. Uh, find her in that cave and come back alive. We're counting on you. Well. Any luck finding those pages? Thank you, Kolgorot. Cor Take some time, but we'll. Uh, but I'll try to make sense of what we have. Aspect. Uh Master poisons who dispatches victims with dead, vicious dagger strikes. A ruthless fugitive who uses agility and guile to send toes to toe with enemies. Subtlety. Uh, let's not just wander out here. Um, a dark stalker who leaps from the shadows to ambush his unsuspecting prey. Backstab. Melee attack that generates one combo point and deals more damage when you stop the ta when you when you're behind the target. I'm used to that being back attack only, because if memory serves, that used to be it. So then again, maybe what I'm thinking of is actually. Uh, Bribe. Bribe's a non-player <laughs> A bribe's a non-player humanoid target up to level 55 with fool's gold, convincing it to fight for you for five minutes. Only up to level 55? That's kind of sucks. It's nice. But I would have liked, you know, like if you could level with you kind of ability. Then again, maybe there's a talent for it. Uh, I thought there was a, another ability. 
Ow. Like down in the list here. Uh, yeah, maybe it's ambush. Maybe that's what I was thinking of. Oh, I have no idea anymore. I'm almost tempted in sticking with assassination because I like the idea of messing with poisons. Queen size troubles. We had a different spec before Rogue. Well, Rogue's a different spec before. It's assassination and subtlety. It wasn't Outwall. It was, that was something else. Didn't think I could pull that off, but well, I sure showed me, didn't I? And here's the uh, big Bertha. Let's make sure we don't attack her before we I need to. Get closer. It's done. Da, da, da. This rate. Now oh, she's missed most of her health. Beautiful. And Poisoned Knife actually does award. Uh, a single combo point as well. That should be kept in mind. Must be awkward to stealth on cobweb. And especially since wouldn't. I remember hearing maybe it's just for smaller spiders and you know in real life that spiders can detect when a prey has entered their web by the vibrations in it. Then again, those webs typically are smaller, as are the spiders. Maybe it's a different, uh, you know, the situation, since the situation is so much greater, is so much different, when they're, you know, fucking titanic, they can't do that anymore. Brr. Actually, seeing those giant spiders reminds me of, um, it's making me think again of, uh, Dark Messiah of Might and Magic. That was a fun game. Hmm. I guess those herbs are to do with a quest. Played a fair. B I've actually completed Dark Messiah Might and Magic. It's not a bad game. Though most of the game, it, it, for anyone who hates sewer levels, well, the ma vast majority of the game is sewer levels. Well, actually, maybe that's not fair. Well, I remember someone saying that before, but I'm not sure if they're entirely accurate. Um, kind of said it without thinking. Um. A lot of the game is catacombs, fair bit of sewer level to it, certainly. But, um. Yeah, there's a lot of catacombs and whatnot to it. Um, I find the pacing in one area isn't the best. Um. Just insofar as, um. I feel just one zone goes on for too long. Um. And would like a change of scenery. Why are you wandering down this path? It's a fucking ominous. Like seriously. But yeah, anyway, I'll probably do a let's play of Dark Messiah at some stage. Um, it's owned by Ubisoft, so I can do a let's play of it. And I also plan on doing the Assassin's Creed games at some stage, whenever I can be bothered. Oh, <coughs> sorry. I'm gonna stop again and take another drink. Okay. No, oh, sorry about that. I just really needed a drink. Ooh, excuse me. Christ, he knocked over the bottle. Ain't you a chipper looking one? I don't know. Great job, Colgrot. We've heard rumors of survivors further in the mountains. Now we'll be able to send scouts there. Long live Greymane. What is it? It took a while, but I think I've put together what happened here, at least partially. There were survivors of the curse in this town. They joined others in the mountains in, in Tempest. In, they joined others in the mountains in Tempest Reach. Everyone left except the man who kept the journal, Old Man Bradshaw. He noticed that the work of the tax had stopped all of a sudden and decided to venture into the Blackwald. There is an abandoned mill just northeast of town. It was where Bradshaw lived. 
See if you can find any clues there. Sure. I wonder why he didn't leave. And why the attack stopped all of a sudden. Also, wasn't I meant to be getting the next dosage of my... The thing keeping me sane? Because I didn't get that. Probably should. It's not like we got, you know, Mandrake Essence hanging around, though. Somehow I have a feeling this isn't Bradshaw unless he's really convincing a cosplay. Actually, I saw one cosplayer and does a really, really convincing D uh, diva cosplay. You know, the gal from um, uh, Overwatch. Until someone said in the comments, I didn't realize it was a guy. You know, it's just really fucking convincing. Seriously. I've been expecting you, Cole Garot. Do not be alarmed. My name is Belsara. I am a priestess of the moon, a night elf. You might not, not you might not know my people, but the destinies of our two races have been linked since the curse befell you. You you have many questions, Cole Garot, and they'll be answered in time. I know why you're here and what you're looking for. I can't lead you there with the enemy tracking you. One of Sylvanas' scouts has been following your tracks. You can't leave the Forsaken to the place you seek. Take this talisman, and walk along the road just north of here. Let the ranger lure you to our trap. Use the power of the talisman to break free and counterattack. Sure. Sure, random elf. I'll do what you say. Uh, free yourself from the Dark Scout's freezing trap. Christ. I'm also still salted. Such easy prey. Sylvanas will be most pleased. You can't see me. You can't see me. Escape before she shoots you. Christ! Pop a potion. I should have used the thing, but it just didn't look like she was going to open fire. I didn't expect her to try and one shot me. And I was hoping she wouldn't actually, you know, fire because I was still actually cloaked and whatnot. Now oh, that didn't work out well. Can I actually use the item from there? There we go. How did you- It doesn't matter. I don't need a trap to defeat you. Seriously. I, what do I do for your powerful ass bow? Journeyman's robe. Uh, nah. It's a mage thing. Or caster thing. Let's go over here and grab this. And there's even more rose, roses over this way. So, oh Christ, 225 gold, nice, 86 gold, uh, 114, 5 gold, 50, not half bad, great money. Well done, Cole Garot, the scout never had a chance. Well, she did when I was fucking around. There are others like you, Cole Garot, and they too were lost and confused. Also, Tal Doren, the Wild Home. There is a place where you belong. Tal Doren, the Wild Home, was once home to an order of druids who took the shape of wolves. It is there you will find the answers you seek. It is also there that you will find someone who can offer, you, uh, who can offer guidance. An old friend. Darius Crowley. Maybe they shouldn't have spoiled that there. You know? 
sometimes having things like that kind of ruins the surprise of things, you know? Oh, excuse me. Coke. Hmm. Probably was thinking, you know, when I make my human rogue, maybe I should have them as a miner and herbalist. You know? Might be a nice thing. Extra money. But part of me is thinking, nah. Um, it's fine on this character, considering I'm not going to play them after this. But I want them to be a Skinner and... Uh, Skinner and what's the other thing? Uh, Weather Worker. Considering they're a rogue, they should be able to make their own gear. So, yeah, I think that would be a better idea. So what's this blue sap it's weeping? It's weird. It's creepy. And here's the Feral Watchers. And there's just random... What in here there's story? like... Level 10 Elite Feral... Uh... Morgan. Talran of the... Talran of the Wilds. Level 10 Elite. V uh... Vasanda. Storm... Call. Was she in Wad? I'm not sure. Lyros. Swiftwind. I think he was in Wad. We do what we must. And here's Darius. No Rebel Valor, though. You're alright, Kolgaroth. I've been waiting for this day for a long time. It is truly great to see you, friend. How long was I out of it? And a war... Well, I'm a werewolf. Like, Christ. Uh, and a squeaky. I've heard of what you've done. I'm thankful. Especially for Lorna. She's all I've left. I'll send for her right away. The Night Elves have told us much during this time, Kolgorod. They've told us who we are and where we come from. Thanks to them, thanks to this place, we're no longer mere beasts. We have regained free will. The Forsaken aren't here for our land alone. They're looking for something to we possess. An artifact capable of uncontrollably spreading the curse to all humanity. We cannot let them have it. So Vlanus's banshees have come very close. How my trackers take them out? What you know as a curse began as a heresy among our brethren. Faced with a losing battle against demonic forces, the druids of the pack eschewed the bounds they were sworn to and allowed the beasts to overtake them. They're banished to the Emerald Dream, where they live in eternal slumber under a tree identical to this one, but not before they, their curse spread to others. Today, our ceremony will restore bounds to your people. Bring me the leaf that grows only in Tal Duren's vicinity. Oh, Moon leaves. And actually, since of herbalism, it's on the map. I presume if I didn't, it wouldn't. No, it wouldn't be. So, kill six banshee, gather six herbs. Gotcha. Just realized I probably ran out of Final Fantasy XIV time. Because I've been just playing nothing but this since the mic went uh, buggery. Eh, I needed to get this done anyway, so if it's motivated me to, to get this done, then job done. So, you know, that's what's important. Buck, we've been going for two, three hours now. Not half bad. I probably won't get this done in one thing, but still. What I've done so far is pretty damn good. I'm out of range. Somehow I poisoned the fucking Banshee. Uh, I, I, actually, fuck that. Somehow I've stabbed the Banshee. And actually, uh... Oh, what's the thing called? There is, uh, you know, he like, a uh, Headless Horseman? Uh, like, beyond that, just that myth. You know, the Irish one. Uh, there, it's like, basically, it's basically the Headless Horseman. Um, but, it, it's not called Headless Horseman. There's an Irishy name to it. It probably has its own mythos. It's a similar thing, a Headless Rider, but it's its own thing. I just had a flash before my eyes there. I remember people doing sexy versions of that. Yeah. Uh, DeviantArt. 